Okay, welcome back to Teacher Look class. And today we'll be discussing booklet one, the 15 must score basic topics. And this is page number nine and question number 10. So let's look at this question together. Now, here's it. Jean packed 408 cupcakes into a number of boxes. Okay, now each box can contain either 10 or 6 cupcakes. Now, key thing here. Given that Jane used the least number of boxes to pack all the cupcakes, now all the cupcakes, how many boxes contain 10 cupcakes each? Now, the very important keyword here that you should know here is use the least number of boxes. Now, when they say the word use the least number of boxes, means that you need to know that you should have have the highest number of uh, boxes that with 10 cupcakes. Why? Teacher, you might ask, teacher, why? Huh? Why must we have the highest number of boxes that contain 10 cupcakes? Because if in order to use the least number of boxes, we, that box must have more cupcakes so that we can use lesser. Make sense? If we have more cupcakes in the box, then we need to use lesser the boxes. Okay, this is the same concept here. Which means that our target here is to maximize uh, the 10, the boxes with the 10 cupcakes so that we can have more inside the box. Okay, so now 408, so first we need to divide by 10. Why? We try to figure out what is the maximum we can use. So we use 1 times 10, no, 4 times 10, this is 40, then 8. Oops, we can't put it, so we put 0, there will be 0, and 8 is the remainder. So it means that if I have 40 boxes, okay, this is boxes, uh, for the 10 cupcakes, I have how many remainder here? I will have eight remainder, which means eight cupcakes remain. A, there's a problem here. Why? Because I know that there are two kind of boxes here. Either the box that contain 10 or contain six. But now I have eight cupcakes extra. You see here, I have eight cupcakes extra. But my boxes can either 10 or six. So which means that I can't have 40 uh, boxes that I can fit in 10 cupcakes. So if I know it's not 40, then it can't be 41, right? It doesn't make sense. So let me just minus one. And let's go to the second possible situation, which is 39, okay? If I have 39, the boxes that can fit in 10 cupcakes, I know that if there's 39, uh, means that I have extra, so I have eight here, right? Means that here now I have 18 extra cupcakes or the remainder now. Can, does it make sense? 18 cupcakes actually, if you know this, 18 actually is the multiple of 6. Because we know, we know 3 times 6 is equal to 18. So it means that actually, I have 3 boxes that con contain that 6 cupcakes. That's why 3 times 6 is equal to 18. And somehow, if you're able to see, actually it fit in all 408. Cupcakes, right? That's why here mentioned what? Pack all the cupcakes. And now, what's the question asking? How many boxes that contain 10, 10 cupcakes each? And for sure, I know there's 39 boxes. And we are done with this question. Okay. Thank you. And I hope you get this question. And feel free to ask me in the class if you don't understand. Thank you. And see you. Bye-bye.